Hey guys, today I want to talk about C and C++ development tools. If you code in C or C++, you probably know that the two most popular IDs out there are JetBrains, C Lion, and Microsoft's Visual Studio Code. C Lion and VS Code has its own strengths and weaknesses, so in this video I want to compare these two. Let's first talk about their similarities. Both C Lion and VS Code are cross-platform, meaning you can run them in Windows, Mac, or Linux natively. They support basic functionalities such as autocomplete, autosuggest, find references, jump to definitions, and syntax analysis. These are the bread and butter features that a developer most frequently needs, and both C Lion and VS Code do the job very well. Debugging is probably the most critical process in the development cycle, and both C Lion and VS Code support excellent debugging environment. Though configuration may be a bit tricky at first time, once you configure it correctly, you can debug your program line by line, step in, step out, step over with easy to configure keyboard shortcuts. You can easily set and remove breakpoints, modify break conditions, and examine variables at different stack frames. Lastly, they both support most popular C and C++ build systems, including Makefile and CMake. Since most C and C++ projects are based on these build systems, you can easily import most C and C++ projects with just a few clicks. Now let's talk about their differences. First, the pricing. C Lion is a paid subscription software with one month free trial, while VS Code is a free software. There are, however, a few ways to use C Lion for free. For example, it's free if you are a student, and you can request a free license if you want to use C Lion for an open source project. So, does it make VS Code a better choice? Hardly, as you will see in just a moment. C Lion is a dedicated C and C++ development software, while VS Code is technically just a multi purpose editor. That is to say, you can use C Lion as an IDE out of the box, but for VS Code, you need to install a few extensions before you can actually use it for C, C++ development. With that said, C Lion in fact has much more built-in features compared to VS Code. For example, you can easily generate methods to override or implement in a child class in C Lion, but there is no such functionality in VS Code, at least with its official C++ extensions. There may be a third-party extension for it, but it will be a hassle to look for an extension for every feature you need. Even if you find one, there is no guarantee in the quality of the third-party extension. Another big difference is refactoring capabilities. Refactoring with C Lion is intelligent and it just works. For example, if you simply change your file name, it is automatically reflected in the CMake file accordingly. With VS Code, unfortunately, that does not happen. You need to manually rename the file again in CMake file, which is quite annoying. Another example would be changing the signature of a method. In C Lion, this is a breeze with a just a built in feature. In VS Code, there is no such feature, and I guess you'll need to manually change one by one. This is especially painful if you have a lot of child classes overriding this method. So with these convenient features in C Lion, do we have a clear winner? Uh, not really, as there is no free launch. All the advanced features in C Lion comes at a cost. C Lion consumes so much RAM and CPU resources that it literally drains the battery. With the minimal Hello World project open, C Lion consumes 2 gigs of RAM, while VS Code consumes only 200 megs. With my Intel based MacBook Pro, I wasn't really able to use C Lion much without power plugged in, as C Lion was literally hogging the CPUs, draining the battery within hours, even with a relatively small project. With my new M1 MacBook Air, it has greatly improved, but it still drains noticeably quicker with C Lion running. VS Code, on the other hand, is not so much of a problem. So what is the final verdict? Well, if you are a beginner and do not require advanced features and functionalities that C Lion offers, then VS Code is the right choice for you. It's free, it's light, it's easy to use, and has all the essential functionalities as an IDE. However, if you're an advanced developer or need to develop for work, then I definitely recommend C Lion as it's more powerful and really makes so much easy and enjoyable to code. All right, hopefully you guys find my video useful. I'm curious of other people's take on C Lion versus VS Code comparison. So please feel free to share which one you like and why. Thanks for watching and I'll see you next time.